Yes, and today we are talking about the cycle of abuse. If you have uh, dated an abuser or, you know, um, seen your friend date an abuser, you definitely know that, they, that there is a cycle. You know what I mean? Yeah. He beats you, he apologizes, you guys are good, and then you go back to, you know, there's a whole cycle mm. to it. So that's what we're talking about today. Have you been yes. in an abusive relationship? Never, ever. Emotional, even? Oh, emotional, yes, but um, physical. Physical, oh, I, physical oh, yeah. me, by them, kekwa me daddy. I'm going to get a jail. Like something. <laughs> something. <laughs> hey, to an end, my friend. Well, well, let me tell you, the first, the first uh, emotional abuse mm -hmm. relationship and physical abuse relationship I was in, mm -hmm. I had just left another relationship. That was working a little bit, but yeah. I didn't like some things in the relationship, so I moved to this one. So mm -hmm. I was very intentional on making it work, mm -hmm. right? So this guy... I was super naive, didn't yeah. know how to to kana people. Mm. Like I was just being that good girl. Mm -hmm. and then he he would be that guy that comes home drunk and abuses me. What? Like ile matusi, what is this? But in time <laughs> I learned to survive. Mm -hmm. And for me survival meant having some of the traits that he had mm -hmm. so that I could blend in, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So Tuna that meant ata mimi na ru Narusha. Hey, you are a Kirusha. Uh, physical. Ikikuja. Ah. Situende. Yeah, Wacha katambe. Na kimbia jikoni kisu. That, that was ha. the end. Like I was like. That's when you realized what the hell. What? I'm gonna mm. kill someone. Uh -huh. What if I kill someone? You, you know? know. But then. This was the cycle. He would do that. Mm -hmm. He would bring, actually have external stressors mm -hmm. and then come back to me. Mm -hmm. And bring. Out on you. Exactly. Project yeah. his yeah. anger on me. Mm -hmm. And then physical abuse. Mm -hmm. And then. Reconciliation. Reconciliation. Like, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. And then this is the part. If he has the money, he has the money to foot your bills. You know and basically, I mean? he'll even take you to Dubai. You he'll know? take you to all these fancy bad, places and give you money bad, and, and roses and say yeah. you're sorry. And then things are calm and then for a while. Calm for a while. And then, and then the storm of a paradise. They, they, they calm before the, the storm. The storm mm. And then now the storm again. Yeah. You know, it's like a circle yes, that repeats true, itself. And it's true. really sad. Uh, it's a thing that when someone gets so used to doing something, something and yeah. they know utatulia yeah they know how to know handle you, you afterwards. Mm -hmm. yeah. They know I need to get a gift, I need to take her somewhere, I need to do ABCD. Mm -hmm. Then, this story is going to be So, ni kitu unapata. Ye pia mwenye kwa kichwake na jua, ah, ini kawaida. Yeah. You get. So, they are used to doing that. But I'm like, you know, at the end of the day, I feel, um, personally, I was in a, at a state of relationship, in a situation. Yeah. I was in a situation and that person was very abusive. But, yeah. what I did, mm. I never used to respond. Right. Like, I'm those people, yeah. utaonge, well, I was just, and then say look pin I'm trigger more because an attacker would you like do that? Yes, I do have a temper. Mm. But of course ni kwa a temper and we keep panda, it's a different evil. thing and I don't know yeah. what I can do. Mm -hmm. So the fear of what I can do, Niki yeah. Fikayo point in Kwenafanya, I'd rather stay down. Mm -hmm. But then you get to a point you understand. This is not normal. Like mm. honestly, whatever the cycle is just yeah. something that is never going to end. Saying yeah. nene kwa hard, but you need to bounce. Yeah. You know, just because you're talking like Leoni, Evi, 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 Evi. Then you're talking like Oh, Pole, you're talking like Sirika, Diki, Sirika. I just see you like Sirika. But That's at the true. end of the day, you need to learn how to take a pause and chill mm. and think about what you're doing. I'ma watch you saying. Si kila sana shino kufanya one story sawa sawa. But all the time, yeah. I, I was mad. That's why I insulted you. Yeah, and you know so, that's the thing. They always apology end up without exactly. an apology. No, they usually end up blaming yeah. you. Yeah. You see, when you do such things, you just make me annoyed. Exactly. I'm like, excuse me, At like you're a you 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 be, Yeah, that's why I did that. Yeah. Yeah. You, you can like, deal with your feelings no. better. You're a, you're an exactly. adult. You're not, a, you're not a child throwing mm. a tantrum. You know what I mean? But I, I personally cannot speak on um physical abuse that I've never been through mm. because me, I believe if someone hits you once, they're gonna hit you again. Yeah. I've, uh, I, I've said this story before. Someone who had anger issues and he punched a wall and I was like yeah next time that wall is going to be me so yeah. I was out mm -hmm. but emotional abuse definitely it always starts kidogo, which yeah. is what um, is referred to as building of tension yeah. he's not done anything but mnanza kuvurugana yeah. alafu sasa the insults come Cindy, yeah. after you insult each other anarudi anakombe oh my god I'm so sorry I don't even know you keep forgiving me blah 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 and then the things are calm for a while you know yeah. you guys are good alafu inanza tena building of tension mnanza kuvurugana vitu vza yeah. Same thing, he insults you again. You fight, okay, for me personally, we used to like argue for like two days straight. Alafu on the third day, he, 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 he will ask for forgiveness. And then we are good for like two weeks. Mm. And then it starts again. So if you're ever in a situation like that, trust me, if he does it once, he's going to do it again. Because me, people who insult, like, the, you know, 
something as simple as when I tell you, because I used to tell him, don't curse at me. You know what I mean? But he used to do it, especially when we're in an argument. I'm like me, as upset as I am, I'm not going to curse at you. Yeah. I'm going to say a few things that are hurtful because you say things that are hurtful, but I'm not going to curse at you. So trust me, if such things happen, that's a red flag. Don't yeah. ignore yeah. it. Because me, I ignored it and ended up wasting almost a year of my life with that guy. You know, I'm always so saying, yeah. uh, whatever comes out of your mouth can kill or yeah. can build. Yeah. It can grow, ama it can be the end of everything. Mm. And sometimes you don't realize, you can say something, you always say this, mm. you can take it back, yeah. But you get, there are things you can't take back. There are mm. things that you're ready to kishask that person, mm. there is no Be going forever. back. Yeah. So anything else you take, they yeah. go back to, that you're the reference point. Yeah. Yeah. To yeah. Yeah. Pale pale. So it becomes a whole thing, in your yeah. cycle in your issue. But I'm like, if you are, if you are with, mm. ama if you have someone, mm -hmm. who's emotionally abusive, abusive. Trust me, that person is not going to change. Mm, yeah. If it's a cycle like you've been seeing it, that person is not going to change. Maybe you need to reconsider why you're with that person. Mm. You need to just bounce. Because yeah, you, you don't need that kind of worse. situation. Yeah. At emotional abuse, sometimes it's even worse it's than worse. physical. Because you know you there are no scars. You know when someone beats you, you can be like, look, this is why he hurt me. Uh, but emotional, I, I, exactly. Yeah. 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 I always say that when we talk about these stories, it's not because... Uh, we are telling you leave your marriage or mm. relationship mm -hmm. but if we are telling our story we are telling how we survived mm -hmm. it's a survival guide for you it yeah. doesn't you don't have to do have what to we what did we you know yeah. you don't have to be the guinea pig mm -hmm. anyway guys we have to move to the next uh, segment of the show it's time for advice spot <laughs> 